wondering if you could play that song again. The one that goes bee boo boo bop boo boo beep. Hey, so everything's online in school because of what's going on. And I got a story about a time when I was in class and a teacher called on me and I was in bed asleep. So it's nine in the morning and I just woke up to my alarm and I'm gonna get in class. And most teachers say, leave your camera on please so I know you're here. I wanna see your beautiful faces and, and all this stuff. The, just a, it's a trick to keep your camera on so they, they know they're in the class. Which I understand. I mean, it's kind of hard to teach to a room full of just like empty, empty pictures of your name and everything. So I usually keep my camera on, um, or at least try to. And today I was just way too tired, and I just couldn't, couldn't turn my camera on. I probably looked like a dead man. So it's nine. I hop in the Zoom class, and I'm exhausted. I'm still in bed, and my camera's off. She's taking attendance. I hear my name get called. And I'm like, here. That's it. And I think, okay, well, she didn't tell me to turn my camera on. I think I'll be fine. And it's had a 10 minutes go by in class. And he, I don't even know how long it was in class, but I was, I was closing my eyes, dozing off. I was about to sleep again. And then I hear her say, um, can you turn your camera on, please? There's like three of you without your cameras on, and I need you guys to turn your cameras on. And I'm laying in bed, like, you know when you're sleeping in bed and you got like one eye open and the rest of your body's asleep? Boy, that was me in that moment. My whole body is asleep, I'm like frozen, one eye's awake just in case I like, she says this, and I just wasn't prepared. She says, turn your cameras on everyone. And I jolt out of bed, get a hoodie on, open my blinds, and I sit, turn my camera on, and I look dead. Like, the most tired I've ever been in my life. I probably had eye bags, like, darker than the freaking night. And I was just, oh my, uh, it, was, it was a terrible Zoom experience. So, anyways, I'm sitting in class. After I turn my camera on, she calls on me for a question. And I am lost, because I wasn't paying attention for the first, like, 30, 20, 20 30 minutes of class. I'm just lost. And it was something something about math. And I just don't remember how to do the math. And it was like, I, I answered the question wrong, of course. And she goes over how to do it. And it was the easiest thing. And I felt so dumb. But later on, I realized that there's a way to get around this Zoom camera thing. And I had to put the theory to test. So my theory was, I can say that I am eating. And I don't want to be seen eating on camera or, or, or over the Zoom. So I tried this in one of my more lenient teacher's classes. Um, um, and he he bought it. I was still in bed, and I was, he's like, uh, can you turn your camera on, please? I'm like, oh, I'm, I'm eating right now. I'll turn it on in a little bit. Bought me an extra like 10 minutes in bed and I got up and I wasn't fully dead when I was turning on the camera because I got a little, little extra extra sleep and then I tried in another class but this time I said oh I'm I'm making breakfast right now I can't uh, I can't turn it on he's like oh what are you making boom on the spot it's like I had this scripted oh I'm just making waffles with Nutella classic breakfast great nutrition of course, from the Nutella. Uh, anyways, I go to try it in my class, that my math class that I previously was asleep in and failed to answer a question. And she says, I need everybody to turn your cameras on. I am the last person to turn my camera on. Well, I didn't even turn it on. But I'm the, I'm the only person without my camera on. And she goes... There's one person who needs to turn their camera on. camera on. Can you please turn it on? And I was like, all right, I got to try it. I'm eating breakfast right now. And she says, okay, I just need to see your face for like two minutes. And I'm like, no, it didn't work. So I had to get out of bed again, sit down. 
turn on my camera for a couple minutes. And she's like, okay, I see you're here. You can turn your camera off. But I'm like, I'm already out of bed now. I can just keep my camera on. I'm not actually going to go eat. So, the plan didn't work the first time. But then, I thought about another strategy. How I used the I'm making breakfast in my other class. And that worked. I got to use it for this math class. Friday rolls around. Teachers love Fridays. They don't have to do anything for the rest of the week. The weekend. Students love Fridays. Everybody loves Fridays. So I'm thinking maybe she'll be a little bit more lenient, you know? It's a Friday. Friday morning. Nobody wants to be awake on a Friday morning for school. And I'm here ready to pull out the I'm making breakfast card. And I'm, the once again, the last person to have their camera off. She's waiting for me to turn it on. And I say... I'm making breakfast right now. I'm going to turn it on in a little bit. And she just says, "All right, it's a Friday. I'll let you I'll let you slide." Something like that. I'll let you uh I'll let you make your breakfast. And I'm like, "Yes, it worked." And then took a little nap. Another like 10 minutes in bed. Got got some nice rest. Woke up again. Sat down, put my hoodie on, turned on my camera, and acted like I just had some nice breakfast. And she was happy to see me. So, now, I've been kind of overusing it. I've been overusing the, the strategy of making breakfast. I'm eating breakfast. I'm eating, or whatever. So I've been trying to think of a new one. And it's just impossible. I think eating is the only way to get around taking putting your camera uh leaving your camera off so i'm thinking i'm thinking i'm thinking and i got it the perfect strategy nobody can stop it you have no proof whatsoever my camera isn't working right now you can't prove it it's impossible a teacher cannot come to your house and say your camera is working i can see that so, what do I do? Use it to my advantage. Now, when I have an early class and I'm way too tired, my camera's not working. I can't turn it on right now. I don't know what's going on. I'm trying to get it fixed. And then the next class, camera's on, camera's on. Next few classes, your camera's on. You can't use it all the time. It's, it's, a, it's when you're really tired. You know, you go to sleep like way too late and it's an early morning class. That's when you use it. It's not the time to like use every time or else they'll be suspicious about it or like why you're not getting it fixed. You can use it like back to back because like, you know, my camera hasn't gotten fixed yet. Another class goes by, still not fixed. Okay, but then next class, you have to get it on or you have to come up with another excuse. But I feel like that's the ultimate, the ultimate excuse is my camera isn't working now I don't con I don't condone missing classes f to sleep but but what we're going through right now all this online school I can't even learn when I'm awake I might as well be asleep you know S isn't sleep good for you that's what I thought so why are we having morning classes when I gotta turn my camera on to not even pay attention anyways that's all for me today peace yeah.